Hey guys, welcome to another daily tip episode here. Today is Friday, February the 20th, 2009. And today I've got another request here. Um, uh, most of you probably have seen our vocal video, and uh, a lot of you left comments. Um, we, that was a pretty popular video. And um, so there was somebody on there that uh, asked about pitch correction and uh, how you can actually do pitch correction. So I'm going to go ahead and show you a couple different ways. One way being the built-in plug-in that comes packaged with Logic. Um, just a regular pitch correction. A lot of other recording software has pitch correction built-in as well. And um, then I'm going to go ahead and show you Melodyne, which is a pretty popular and uh, one of the most realistic sounding uh, pitch correction plugins that I've uh, experienced yet. So let's go ahead and go to my inserts on the vocals. And um, you'll notice, you'll probably hear a little distortion in the vocals, and that's because I have a distortion plug-in actually applied, and uh, I use that to thicken them up. Um, so don't be alarmed when you hear that. So I'm going to go down to my inserts and uh, add a pitch, go down to pitch here, go to pitch correction, and click mono. It's going to bring up my uh, pitch correction here. And uh, if you're looking for that... Um, um, uh, wavy kind of sound that rappers like to use nowadays. Uh, you can drop the response time all the way down. And uh, let's just go ahead and play these vocals and uh, let's go ahead and crazy one of these scales. Let's do something like this. Come gather round and yeah. hear my plea. Take your time and you will see what is and what should be. Right not the that one kind of sounds bad. Well, let's do a different one. Let's try that one. Come gather round and hear my plea. Take your time and you will see what is and what should be. Right not the hustle. So, uh, yeah. That's how you do that little crazy effect. And um, I'm not much on that effect, so I'm going to actually slow that down a lot. And, uh, in fact, I don't really want to hear any of that wavy sounding stuff uh, for what I'm going for. Just basic pitch correction, not doing any effect with it. Um, you'll actually notice that pitch correction actually smooths out the vocals a little bit. So uh, if you're looking to smooth out your vocals, definitely try a pitch correction plugin. So let's go ahead and listen to Come this. Gather round and actually, I'm go back to my the chromatic plea. scale. Take your time and you will see what is and what should be. Still get that wavy stuff, so I'm going to lower the, the response same. time. Well, the things which we've been told of how it should be, it is our call. To make it so. And uh, that's actually pretty good. So uh, that's the built in plugin from uh, Logic, uh, just a normal pitch correction. And uh, now I'm going to go ahead and take that plugin off and uh, turn off my cycle region here. And then uh, I'm going to add Melodyne plugin to show you how you use that. Uh, it's basically the same principle. So let's go down here to Audio Units, uh, Ceremony, Melodyne plugin, and then go to Mono. And uh, for Melodyne, you actually have to uh, record the audio inside of the plugin, and then Melodyne will create its own separate file, and then you can then edit the uh, file that they've recorded, or the plugins recorded. So uh, to do that, you're going to have to pr press transfer here. Now you'll see it's waiting for the audio. And so if you just play this, play it all the way through, um, it'll actually record the audio into this plugin, and then we can edit it. So let's go ahead and play this. And um, as you can see, it's recording. It says recording audio. Um, sometimes it doesn't come out perfectly uh, on time, so hopefully it does this time. <laughs> but um, yeah, once we get that, I'll show you how to uh, uh, edit the um, um, pitch. And uh, you can do some pretty cr crazy stuff with this program. Come get so I'm not going to get real deep into it. Hear my plea. Take your time and you will see what is and what should be. We're not the same. Well, the things which we've been told of how it should be. It is our call to make it so. All right. So now it's detecting the audio. It's already recorded it, and now it's gonna it's 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 applying the the uh, effect. All right, and now you can see all of our notes are there. And uh, in just a minute, I'll actually show you how you can drag those notes up in pitch, and it actually sounds fairly realistic. This is definitely one of the most realistic sounding uh, pitch correction plugins that I've heard yet. 
but to uh, correct the pitch here you can just go here uh, click correct pitch and then uh, I wouldn't recommend doing these a hundred percent I'm just gonna do it about 75 and 60 let's go ahead and click OK now it's should have corrected the pitch there fairly well and uh, let's go ahead and play that. I'm going to turn my cycle region back on. I think it's on already. Let's go back here. Yep, it's on. And uh, so let's go ahead and play that and see what it sounds like. Come gather around and hear my plea. Take your time and you will see what is and what should be. Run not the same. As you can see, that's it's getting a little wavy there too so I've actually corrected the pitch a little too much so I'm gonna go ahead and undo that and I'm not gonna do that again but uh, if there's only a few notes that you'd like to um, put back on pitch um, just go to this edit little edit pitch thing here and you can just double click on the notes to uh, slide them back into pitch here so I'll just do the first little part here and see what that sounds like Gather round and hear my plea. Take your time. So that's pretty good right there. And like I said, this is the most realistic sounding plugin, uh, auto tune plugin that I've heard. Uh, and again, I was talking earlier about dragging the pitch up. All you have to do is hover over the, the note here and you'll get this little uh, dragging up thing here. And then you can just drag it up. Let's just actually, yeah, let's drag it up and see what that sounds like. It's probably going to sound really bad. But uh, sometimes uh, I like to do this to come up with uh, melodies, vocal melodies. So, uh, yeah, get your creative uh, side working with this plugin. Come gather around and hear my. And that was really bad sounding. But if you don't do it too extreme, it actually sound pretty realistic. Come gather around and hear my plea. Come gather around and hear my plea. See, so uh, that's pretty much how you do some basic cr uh, pitch correction. Like I said, I'm not getting too deep into this Melodyne plugin because there's all kinds of things you can do, but uh, we'll do that in another video probably. So uh, if you have any questions about this or anything else about recording, uh, if you have any requests or ideas, head on over to our website at www.limitless-studios.com. Click our forum link. It'll take you to our forum where you can register and post those ideas or just general chat. So uh, yeah, definitely come check that out and uh, we'll see you in another video.